in this course we'll be looking into character device driver as we said all the hardware devices will have a device file present in slash dev directory so let's go into slash dev and check what all devices are present so a lot of devices are present here so each and every file which you're seeing here is actually associated with an hardware device and each and every file is either a character device file or a block device file so how do I find out whether it is a character device file or a block device file so if I can say ls minus l or I can simply say ll and that will ll if you see the first character if it is c this means it is a character device file if it is a d it means it's a directory and if you see it is a b so a lot of character files are there if you see it is a b it means it's a block device file so if you see c if the first character is c it is a character device file if you see d it is a directory if you see b it is a block device file so let's if if i only want to search for character device files i can just do an ls minus l and grep for c then it will list only the device files of character devices so you can see ttys is serial port so a lot of ttys are console terminals and you have frame buffer you have frame buffer etc so you have a lot of devices uh, character device uh, f device files here so character device files they start with c and you can see we have nearly 160 plus character device files what about the device block device files it starts with b so the sd and sda1 is actually my hard disk so hard disk will have something like as sda and sda1 is the, the only partition which i have here then we have some of the loop devices and also the ram disk will also be considered as a block device there are a few uh, block devices in comparison to character devices